There it is, guys, the back axle for the JK Max. It's ready to be installed. But before I do that, um, I wanted to take the back cover off, have a look at the gears inside. And I was surprised to see that they were straight cut gears, straight cut pinion as well. Um, but maybe this is an upgrade that Capo has coming, right? Like different upgrades that will be available. Um, I noticed there was some grease in here. And I know a lot of you guys that are more experienced will, will tell me that what I'm about to do might be wrong. Wrong. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and take here's some cow RC utter butter. This is basically a uh, waterproof grease I've been using this product for a long time and I'm you know normally you wouldn't see me doing this unless I was using this axle and I'm just going to fill up that space because it's summertime I'm going to have a lot of heat going on and you guys would be like what are you doing? If it was winter, I would not be filling up this space but if there's grease in there like this, I'm going to keep out a lot of mud. Plus, I'm also going to have my bearings uh, more uh, protected against any kind of water or splashes. And in the winter, I would be cleaning all this out because for me, it would get cold and quite thick in there. You don't want any kind of binding issues. So I'm going to go ahead, put my cover back on, and basically do it up and get back to work. So smooth.
All righty, my friends, that's where I'm going to leave it today. Ah, I know, we're all excited to see this Jeep out rolling around. Being an all-metal Jeep, I am having a great time putting it together. Got inside and got that interior done. Love the lit-up dashboard. Love the fact that we've got a steering wheel on a servo. The interior seats are awesome. They're very thick. It feels like quality. And everything is going together perfectly. All the holes are lining up. I haven't stripped out any of these stainless steel screws yet. Uh, I shouldn't have said that because that can jinx the process of course, but overall guys, I am super stoked. Thank you so much for joining me today. I am having a good time taking my time, putting my build together, making sure to do it right, using as much Loctite as needed. Uh, and uh, we're just going to continue on in the next episode. So please smash that like button. If you're loving this project, show me it. Uh, let me know in the comments section down below blow that section up and we will see you in the next episode of rc adventures now get outside and have some fun with rc you know i always do bye for now